hippos. With its dopey face, puffy body, and short stubby tail, the hippopotamus is one of the animal kingdom's most deceptive killers. Among the most dangerous creatures on earth, hippos lull victims into a false sense of security with pudgy cuteness and then strike with lightning reflexes and scimitar teeth. But not everything about these animals is terrifying. Their tiny tails are hilarious not only in design, but in function as well. Dominant male hippos mark their territory by scattering excrement, but they're too fat and lazy to walk around to do so. Instead, they twirl their little tails around like leathery propellers and defecate into the whirling blades. And so they spread their feces, mixed with a touch of urine for extra pungency, haphazardly in all directions to deter rival bulls from encroaching on their land. Oddly enough, juvenile hippos are inexplicably drawn to smelly dumps, and young are known to follow older males around to lick at their rear ends. Trapjaw ants. Trapjaw ants have shears for mandibles and can snap them at 40 meters per second. With such speed and size, they can easily cleave enemies in half in the blink of an eye. Amazingly, it turns out they can use their oversized jaws for defense as well as assault. Researchers had noted that the ants would sometimes flick themselves into the air with their incredibly strong mandibles. It wasn't clear why, possibly as an evasive maneuver. As always, scientists tried to understand this puzzling behavior by reproducing it in the lab. They brought in some ant lions, larger insects that love to eat ants. To capture their prey, ant lions build pits in the sand that crumble beneath the unlucky ant's feet. Waiting inside the pit, the ant lion gobbles up anyone that falls through. Sure enough, trap jaw ants that were at risk of sinking into the sand sometimes use their mandibles to propel themselves away from danger. Furthermore, the ants that had their jaws glued together were only half as likely to escape their fate as dinner. Owls. Owls are the wise old patrons of the animal kingdom. Under their sagacious sheen, the birds are adept assassins. In fact, Owl bodies are packed with loads of evolutionary goodies that allow them to locate and effortlessly swoop down on any creature that piques their appetite or ire. One indispensable facet of the owl's toolkit is its face. Owls sport flat, elliptical faces. They're able to use them as biological satellite dishes. The iconic flat shape funnels sound waves toward the ears, allowing the owl to detect the slightest of rustles. The ears themselves are also quite odd because they are not level. Instead, one ear rests above the other. This provides owls an even more accurate audio survey of their surroundings because they automatically account for the slight time difference between sound waves reaching each ear. This amazing adaptation gives owls a sense of hearing ten times sharper than ours and the ability to pluck unassuming rodents from underneath layers of snow. Some turtles, white-throated snapping turtles, as well as other turtle species, faced a tricky evolutionary challenge. They're turtles. Slow of foot and short of weapons, these animals prefer to avoid confrontation by hiding underwater. Constantly resurfacing for air would leave them vulnerable to attack, so the turtles developed a resourceful skill. They breathe through their anuses. Seriously, unlike the single-function anuses of other creatures, the turtle's end tube is called a cloaca and deals with the evacuation of all waste. It also takes up respiratory duties, too, so the furtive turtles can remain safely submerged for days at a time. Through this cloacal respiration, the turtle draws oxygen from water that passes through its backside. Think of it like anal gills, and remains hidden from predators. Sadly, murky water caused by all sorts of industrial processes is mucking up the turtles' anuses and has left them teetering on the brink of being wiped out of their preferred habitats. Full of sediment and chemical crud, the harsher waters have limited these poor creatures' evasive efforts, and it's believed that less than 1% survive to adulthood. Bats, bats pull off all sorts of insane acrobatics to catch their prey, and scientists want to steal their secrets to build better aircraft. As the only mammals clever enough to have mastered self-powered flight, the speedy daredevils offer a different technological inspiration compared to birds and flying insects. But in light of a recent study, we're probably not getting bat-winged planes anytime soon. Bat wings are nothing short of miraculous. Researchers recorded activity in the bat's sensory neurons as puffs of air were shot at the many tiny hairs on their wings and found an incredibly complex wing-brain connection. To perform their crazy tricks, bats literally feel out the air using their fuzz as a sensory organ that delivers immediate, detailed feedback about changes in airflow. This incredible tactile sensitivity makes the bat wing the ultimate aerodynamic tool.
far better than anything we've ever created anyway. The multi-purpose wing acts as a propeller, flipper, airplane wing, airfoil, and then some. Horses. Horses are a lot more articulate than we thought. They communicate not only through snorts, brays, and neighs, but also with eyes and ears, the latter of which are highly pliable and used like equine turn signals. In a study, University of Sussex PhD student Jennifer Wathen and her advisor Karen McComb photographed horses looking at buckets of food. They then altered some of the images to obscure either the eyes or ears before scaling the photographs to life-sized proportions and showing them to real horses who were given a choice between two similar feed buckets. While looking at the unadulterated images, test horses tended to go for the same bucket as their facsimile compatriots. When the ears or eyes were obscured, this behavior disappeared. Of the two modifications to the images, the test subjects heeded the directions of the ears a bit more than the eyes. Golden-winged warbler. Sporting signature yellow-tinged patches and weighing in at only 9 grams, golden-winged warblers are adorably tiny. They're also absolute workhorses, embarking on seasonal migrations that span about 5,000 kilometers. In 2014, researchers discovered the warbler's secret superpower, the ability to predict tornadoes. It all started when five geotagged birds surprised scientists by ditching their nesting sites for a 650-kilometer detour to Mexico. This was several days after the completion of their migratory journey, so it wasn't clear why the capricious warblers departed early. The following day, tornadoes swept through the area. It appears that the diminutive warbler's ears are tuned to detect low-frequency noises, such as the rumble of an approaching tornado which the birds can detect a couple days and hundreds of kilometers in advance. Sawfish. The sawfish is a feared aquatic predator. Its large serrated appendage makes for an intimidating weapon that can slice smaller fish clean in half. But the sawfish's multi-tool muzzle can also detect electrical fields produced by living creatures. While dissecting a few sawfish specimens that had died naturally, researchers found their fimbriated snouts were full of tiny pores, these were indicative of the animal's electrical prowess. These sensors are usually dotted around the mouth so that the fish can quickly clamp down on anything unlucky enough to trigger its electrolocation. It's a necessary tool when one lives in exceedingly murky waters, where visibility is measured in millimeters if the sediment has been stirred. By using its saw as an electrical walking stick and rangefinder, the sawfish remains lethal, where most would be blind. That's all for today. Thanks for watching and see you next time.